Hello everybody and welcome back to Subnautica Below Zero. What is that ambiance? Who doth ambiance me? Hmm. Alright. About to run out of storage here. Unfortunately. Should be fine though. Yeah. Alright, just as I thought, it'll take lubricant to make the sea glide. A clean, lean meal. It tastes like reconstituted lobster. Okay. Oh, God. Gotta get used to that. <laughs> Haven't even gone to the sea glide yet. My apologies. Uh, copper wire, battery. Alright. Copper wire, battery. Copper wire, battery. Oop. Oh, wait, no, I'll probably need titanium. Nice. And if I know the sea glide well, sea glide is a personal transportation device used for high-speed free diving. Contains a built-in light and map. Identifiable. Anyways, um, if I know the sea glide as well as I, um, well, if I know, if the sea glide is anything like it is on the first game. It runs out of power pretty quickly, so I'll probably need a spare battery. <laughs> I can make two, in fact. Alright. Nice. Uh, anything else I need? No? Perhaps? Maybe so? Maybe, maybe so? Perhaps I can make another beacon. Just for the... Just for the convenience of maybe, uh... Needing another... Don't know what you'll find out there in the depths. In the dark depths. Alright. I apologize if I'm being slow right now. I just I haven't done this before. Like, played this. One. Do, do, do. Okay, crystalline sulfur. Which, if I remember from YouTube, that. Oh, let me make a flashlight. Well, actually, the Sea Glide has a flashlight on it. Um, compass. Copper. There's a wiring kit. I don't know how to get silver yet. Repair tool, crystalline sulfur. So, I assuming that's from the crash. Um, the crash fish, which is what was... Uh, which is what blew up in my face last video. Um. All right. <laughs> I mean, don't fully know where to go right now, so I guess I'll just venture into uncharted territory. Goodbye. Don't you dare! <laughs> Replenish oxygen. Oh wow. 
says my underwater source of breathable oxygen useful in free diving scenarios oxygen plant depleted that's right it's depleted I have a big lung yeah that's right I only have one lung don't ask about how I don't have the other I don't want to get into it uh. What are you? What are you? Arctic Ray? Are you hostile? Assessment harmless. Cool. Table coral. Warning. Parsing 100 meters. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Oh crap. Uh, that's probably important. <laughs> you know, there's something tells me that oxygen is pretty uh, crucial. Oh my. Yeah, I don't think that's a. Uh, I don't think that's friendly. I doubt it. I, I, I very much doubt it. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Are there any... I wonder how to get farther in the story. Is there any hints in here? Uh... Is it gonna play? It's not playing. I don't know why. Oh, there you go. Robin, guess what? I got the job. I'm going to 4546B. Now I'll be able to improve the mechanical avian amphibian under real-world stress conditions. Listen, I know your stance on Altera, but I just hope you're happy your sis is happy. I sure hope my sis is happy. I can't wait till we talk again. Oh, I wanted to ask you something. Can you watch my Augie while I'm away? I need someone I can trust to look after my best little potato. <laughs> potato, listen. I tried, but that name is just not sticking. He's my little extra bite. I'll leave the starchy tubers nicknames to you. Anyway, if you say yes, thanks, baby sis. Love you. Four five four six B to Robin. Come in, Robin. <laughs> Remember when we used to play old-timey space explorer? This is kind of like that, but it's even harder to communicate. <laughs> well, let's see. I got your last message. Altera is not, as you put it, alterrorizing me. Things are going well. My project has a new name. Say goodbye Warning. to the mechanical baby and oxygen remaining. hello to spy panglings. We're training the bots to mimic the creatures. Check out the photo. And? I think I'm kind of seeing someone. I know it's not like me to Ooh. just find a date, let alone on a mostly uninhabited water planet, but actually, you know what? Forget I said anything. Yeah, it's, it's probably not even a real thing, but anyway, um, I'm sorry to hear Xenoworks might be strapped in the revenue department. Sounds like they still have you busy Xenoworking, though. I know there's no way to guarantee an alien intelligence startup will succeed, but you've put so much into it. I hope they find a way to keep going. I know how much it means to you, getting to work at a small place where you have control over your research. All right, I gotta go. Later, baby sis. Love you. Hey, Robin, I, I got your Augie photo. Thanks so much for taking care of him, even though he's a cranky pot. Hey! The nickname actually fits that way. A cranky potato. I know he can be a handful, but I really appreciate it. I'm a bit worried about my other baby, the mission. One of my panglings found something, something big. But Altera is just like, nothing to see here. Huh. Honestly, kind of glad you can't answer so you can't, you know, rub it in my face. Go ahead. 
bask in the fact that you were a little bit right about them. My project is on the line. My job, my safety. Um, I heard about Xenoworks getting bought. I'm sorry. But at least you still have your job. Guess you're one of us now. Like it or not, welcome to the Altera family. I, I should probably go before I say something I regret. Love you. Keep your chin up. Eye on the alien prize. Hey, Robin. I'm sorry my last message was so awful. I've been under a lot of stress. I'm not sure what's going on with anything. I can't really talk about it either. Oh, and I'm definitely not dating anyone on this water planet. Don't know what I was thinking there. Have I told you how cold it is here? Get this. I can't even get my wash and go dry before the wind freezes the moisturizer in my hair. Wild, right? Well, anyway, I'm sure you're mad at me after what I said, but I, I could really use a friend. You're my sister. I love you. I'm sorry. Hey, Robin. I really need someone to know. I'm afraid something terrible is gonna happen. <sighs> you were completely right about Altera, okay? You were right. I was wrong. The cat should be called Potato. I admit it. <laughs> mm, sorry. Bad attempt at a joke. I, I just... I don't know what to do. I guess I should just come out and say it at this point. I've said this much already. We found a frozen leviathan that's infected with Kara. Altera thinks they can use it for something. Weapons, experimental treatments, a whole range of things. But one end of the range is ugly, dangerous, but, but profitable, of course. What if it gets out while we're messing around with it? Or worse, what if it ends up a bioweapon in the wrong hands? I, I hope I'm overreacting, but... I don't think I am. Anyway, uh, message me back, please. I could really use a friend. Aww. My sister. I love you. Transmission of unknown origin. Source of transmission depth calculated at approximately 200 meters. 200 meters. Is there going to be a signal at my... Maybe it's around here? I should probably get a repair tool. That sounds like a distress call. What? Um. Oh, look at you. Titan holefish. Replenish oxygen. Says an invaluable oxygen source if you can reach it. Okay, cool. I'm assuming the place I have to go is that hole that I saw earlier. This one. I'll test it out. Since I'm not exactly getting a, uh, getting a coordinate yeah there's oxygen down here kelp root assessment harvestable for resources used in fabrication what hold on what I, I'm not getting anything weird what's this I, I'm scared of you kind of Radiant Sieve Cora, or Clora, Cor Coral, I meant. No assessment on that. I'm just going to continue. Hey, buddy. You little jerk. Oh, uh, <laughs> there was a monkey right there. He almost took my sea glide. I don't know if they're able to take the sea glide, but I'm not going to risk it. I'm not gonna risk finding out. Hey, silver! 
Uh. Oh, at a, it's at 200 meters. I'm only 70. Uh oh. Uh. Crystal and sulfur. Nice. That's what I need for the repair tool. So, there wasn't a complete, like, this wasn't a complete waste of time. Silver. Nice. That's what I, that's the remaining I need for the compass. Compasses are always good. Hey, buddy. Wait, what? <laughs> oh! Mobile vehicle bay! Nice! Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Why was there an egg in there instead of a... What? Alright. Jeez, I don't... It told me over here about the 200 meter one, and I'm assuming that it would be over here, right? I'm. I apologize if I'm wrong about this. That's kind of cool looking. It's just common sense would tell me that it's over here since it only told me over here. Whoa, let's hope this doesn't kill me. Frost and uh, an anemone. <laughs> 30 seconds of oxygen. Carefully harvest for high nutritional value. So carefully suggests that it would hurt me. Let's test that theory. <laughs> Hello. Oh. What? I don't understand. Whoa! Oh, that. Uh. Oh no, that was them hurting me. I think. Whoa! What? It? Big giant jellyfish. These are obviously friendly, right? Oh crap! Ah! <laughs> you jerk! Oh god. Okay. Eye jelly. Um, the eye jelly gently drift with little locomotion, though they can track movement with their large, singular eye. They didn't tell me an assessment, so I don't know if they're necessarily harmful. Oxygen. And also, I don't feel exactly safe, given how, um, yeah. Y you can see <laughs> how deep this water is. It could lose, it could definitely support a Leviathan-class, uh, creature. Creature egg? That's crazy. Blueprint synthesized. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. I should probably worry about that. <laughs> What's... Oh, there must be a big giant storm going on. Eh, it's probably fine. It's probably fine. No, no, that's not what I meant to do. Wait, did I? I. Oh, wait, no, no, no. I thought I duplicated it, but I forgot I crafted another one, so. <laughs> Let's 
I do not understand where I'm supposed to go. Is, is it in my data bank? Hold on. I got. I should get to the surface and make sure I don't get my stuff doesn't get stolen by these guys. Wait. Warning. Parsing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decrease. Maybe this is it. What's this for? Found in kelp caves contains highly radi reactive compounds. I thought it said radioactive for a second. C mo bruh. What mobile vehicle <laughs> Wait, are they going to attack me? Uh because I kind of like messed with their nest. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. I don't know. Oh, oh no, oh no, where's the oxygen? No! I th ah! Oxygen. We're fine. Don't freak out! Why are you freaking out? I see you freaking out over there. You're not allowed to freak out around me. Hey, buddy. Creature egg. Lame. Lame. I'm not playing this so I hatch a bunch of different creatures. I'm playing this for the for the story and all that. I'm not playing to create a zoo. Whoa. Architect artifact. Cosmetic. Theoretical versus communication to race storage, holographic display, light display for relaxation purposes. I read that really fast because um, my oxygen is going f uh, down. Not only that, but faster than usual. Because of how deep I am. Come on. Please be down here. Oh! Th this should be the last piece of the... Oh no, laser cutter! Okay. Sea monkey egg. It's pulsating weirdly. I don't like that. Come on, oxygen plants. Uh, I don't want to die! Thank you. Come on, I'm almost 200 meters. Has to be somewhere around here, right? What are you? Spinnerfish? Um, that sounds like a monkey behind me. Or something. Something that does not necessarily like me. <laughs> Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen God. Remaining. Okay, I gotta swim to the surf. Oh, no. Oh, no. There better be a freaking oxygen thing over here. Come on. No, no. Oxygen. There's one over there. Eh. Oh. Come on. I need to get to Warning. surface. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. God. This place... Is just a death trap. Oxygen. Come on, escape. Escape. Oxygen, oxygen, oxygen. There was a nest back there. Oxygen. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Here we go, boys. Freedom! Ugh. I'm going right back down. <laughs> I'm just gonna go right back down. Alright. Let's see what uh, what adventures we get ourselves into this time. What we may find down here that we may have missed. 
Anything here? It looks like something. Laser cutters. Nice. Speed through it. Speed run, boys. Speed run. Come on, boys. Let's go. Hit, get it. Oh. Nice. Laser cutter now achieved. Oh, God. Get away from me. New blueprint synthesized. I don't like those guys anymore. Warning. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Whatever. As if oxygen is important. It, yeah, I'm gonna die down here, on <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I'm prob, I'm probably gonna die. Warning. Uh, Thirty seconds of oxygen. Uh, uh, huh. Yeah. No, I'm fine. I'm gonna head back to base and then see. Actually, no, I'll check my um, PDA if there is a rebreather that I can build. Oxygen. Rebreather, rebreather, rebreather. May have passed over it, I hope. Equipment. It should be in the equipment. I do. Uh, why don't. Why do I not have a rebreather? Why not? Come on. Come on. Gotta be kidding me. Gotta be kidding me. Maybe it's over wh wherever these guys are and it goes really deep. Maybe that's where the thing is that it was talking about. It said something about something 200 meters down. And I intend to find such thing. Picked up what sounds like a distress call. Who or what is out here calling for help? Oh. Didn't sound human. Maybe it's from a remnant of architect technology. In her message, Sam's colleague did say there was something important here. Even if it's just a mimic from one of the more intelligent aquatic specimens, that could be a major find. Or if it's from Altera, it could have bearing on what happened to Sam. I should definitely check it out. Alright, I got a compass now. Um... Uh, not cold and not wet. Well, I guess being not on fire and not injured aren't bad either. Now that I'm settled, I can start to look for you, Sam. I should reread the message your colleague sent me. I wonder why she's acting like Sam is still alive. I don't know. Uh, I'm telling you, Sammy, you see some weird things when you spend half your day in a sea truck. More vandalism? Was it the sea monkeys again? Oh, yeah, we heard that one. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting indeed. I will not end this episode until I get something productive done. Silicon rubber. I'll be disappointed if I don't find that freaking uh, distress thing by the end of this episode. Hold on. I'm going to put these away. Tuck these safely away. Maybe I have one of those. Alright. Uh. 
Alright. Um, I don't know where to go. I wish there was something telling me. Okay, I'll try, I'll try this. I'll try this real quick. Do I not have my repair tool on my bar? There you go. Just in case. I don't know what it could be used for. Um, Warning, parsing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Yeah, sea truck fragment. That's what I was just about to get to. I know it's used to repair vehicles, obviously, but I mean, like, before that, I wonder if there is anything for it to be used on. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. No! Ah! Get away from me! Oxygen. What was that? That thing. Oh, yeah. Screw that thing. Screw it. Oh, my God. I'm still going down, though. <laughs> Say hi again. Hey. How's it going? Maybe try to find out where this uh, distress call is, huh? 200 meters, it said. I'm about 200 meters down. I'll look around. Nice. New blueprint synthesized. This looks promising. Ooh. Maybe this is something. I hope it is. I hope it's just I hope it's not just something weird. I hope it's not it, nothing. That's what I mean. Come on. It said 200 meters. Am I... Beacon signature detected. Unique identifier, Delta Station Dock. Delta Station Dock. Delta Station. This is the place Lil mentioned in her message. I, I extremely apologize if, if I'm being, um... Uh, not that efficient in what I'm doing. I, I promise I'm trying. <laughs> Oh, I do it! Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. What the? There you go. Oxygen. Yeah, that's probably important. All right, I'll go to this for uh, for now. See where it leads me. I'll just get this um any resources on the way, and if I have to, I'll drop some stuff. But that's if I have to. Or vein? What? Detected below. Resources behind loose detected. rock. Caution advised. Oh. oh. That's cool. Warning. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. Hey, who needs oxygen? I don't need oxygen when I got gold.
That's probably safe. Oxygen. Ooh. Beacon. Hey, buddy. Coffee vending machine. I have a feeling that this would be pretty good in this game. It might um, raise my body heat. New blueprint synthesized. Trash can. Uh. Uh. Flood light. New blueprint synthesized. New blueprint synthesized. I'm gonna go into water to warm up. I w which you would think the opposite, but you know what? I'm not going to question. <laughs> this is a recorded message. If you can hear this, you're trespassing. If you know it's good for you, you'll get the hell out of here. Thermal Lily. At night, the thermal lily's petals close to reduce heat loss, and it relies on its heat source to survive the harsh Arctic conditions. Oh, that's cool. So that's what's heating me up right now. Awesome. Horseshoe shrub. Assessment. Fruit can be harvested and planted and could be a sustainable food source. Shrub nut. That's pretty good. Health. It even gives you health. That's a pretty good one. As far as I know, no plants do that in Subnautica. They don't just straight up give you health. It is an unusual plant for this climate. Unlike other plants that manage to thrive in extreme cold, which, is which typically grow close to the ground and lack leaves to prevent moisture loss, the blue scrub um, brush is tall with a fur-like leaf. Within the hollow leaves are chambered pores, which capture and store the sun's heat. The more you know! Isn't that right, heat lily? Honeycomb fungus. No assessment. Uh, these will efficiently pull my nutrients from the soil. Let's see! Nah. <laughs> Might have just wanted them like eats me. Just straight up eats me. Yeah. So uh how'd you die? Oh, I died from a mushroom. Uh really has evil lair vibes. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, that's just straight up crystal and sulfur. But it's like uh, the, the mushroom is bad for you? Nah, it ate me. Wait, what? <laughs> Hold on. That's not right. My special request. It gave me this jailbroken scanner tool thing and said, I need more shower heads. This should lead you to the necessary minerals. What? <laughs> he also told me to keep it on the down low. I guess this is what master's certificate in, in applied geology gets you these days. A job as a glorified construction worker. Ugh. I should have studied interstellar law like dad said. I have to hand it to Emmanuel though. I don't know what he did to the scanner. But it does a great job at zeroing in on specific minerals. It is, it's better than helping I stumble across the right outcroppings. Essential for advanced fabrication. You are pretty cool. Do you hurt me? Ah! <laughs> oh well. I'm gonna assume that he doesn't do that on purpose. Where was it? Uh, am I dumb? Oh! <laughs> 
<laughs> I am dumb. <laughs> well then. Did I just make a loop? I don't know exactly where I'm going, but I'm going places. I sure am going places. Ow. That hot. Does this, like, no? Okay. I don't know where exactly where to go. Maybe this is it? Oh. Stop right there, Altera. You're out of bounds. <laughs> I'm not with all Then your position is doubly precarious. Oh. What do you mean? If you're telling the truth, you're out of your mind. If you're lying, there'll be hell to pay. Wait! Who are you? Stay off my land. Is that? The woman in the exosuit has been traced as far as my technology will allow. Signal location uploaded to PDA. It would appear I'm far less alone on this planet than I had anticipated. Is there like a crouch? <laughs> For the last time, I'm not cheating. Then what's your theory? What's going on? If you ask me, Zeta's been blinking a lot. I think it's tell. He does have a point there. It's allergies. <laughs> allergies? New oh, is something in bloom on this frozen planet? Thermal lilies. And if you gang up on me, I swear you're all fired. <laughs> you're not even my boss. Oh, you're all so gullible. You're fighting each other. Meanwhile, look at Marvin. <laughs> just look at him. What am I doing? I'm not doing anything. Let's just take this to a vote. All those who think Zeta's allergies are a bad case of alienitis, say intruder. New intruder. Uh, intruder. Intruder. Danny? Oh, I'm just an observer here. I'm going to use my pass. Is there some kind of scientist conspiracy going on here? Zeta, Sam, Danielle, you three are suddenly very aligned. Or, like I said, Parvin is cheating. I'm starting to wish I was cheating. A map will come in handy. I should be able to find my way to buy robotics. New blueprint synthesized. So many scannables. <laughs> Jukebox. Yes. <laughs> I get to party. New blueprint synthesized. P what? Pick up snow. J uh, am I able to throw it? Nice. <laughs> I, 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 uh, I don't know if I should be doing that. <laughs> Taking up all my inventory. There will be more snow. If that, if there's a purpose to that. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, damage. Mo it's still a modification, right? Okay. Is that, did I get the blueprint? Yeah. All right. Nice. New blueprint synthesized. New blueprint synthesized. Communications tower maintenance log. Another day, another slight by the winged furies. As usual, I got an interference alert. As usual, I went out to see what the problem was. As usual, it was frozen stalagmites of feathered bird excrement. I fear the career impact of saying this officially. Why is if it? You can even call what I have a career. But I could swear they're targeting me personally. The week I was out with the flu, I came back to New find the tower spotless. 
carved and laughed at me when I asked him how he cleaned it. Silly me. As if Parvin would ever clean anything. There's nothing left for me to do but quit. But I know that's what the birds want me to do. Oh, and I got the tower up and running. Maintenance complete. Communications tower is maintenance it, lock. Is this the... Another day, another slight uh... by the wicked furies. As usual, I got an interference alert. As usual, I went out to see what the problem was. As usual, oh. it was frozen stalagmites of feathered bird excrement. I fear the career impact okay, of saying on. this officially. Oh, there you go. Jenny, you wouldn't believe the adventure I'm having. It's just like when we were kids and we used to play underwater city. Only sea monsters aren't pretend and I don't need to hide behind you when one swims by. Because I'm safe in my sea truck. Safe and very, very brave. <laughs> Please tell Dad for me. That's Thanks so cute. much for the mustache kit, by the way. To be honest, I wasn't sure if it was a gag gift at first. Personal grooming is something of a challenge here. And as you know, I'm a pretty low-maintenance guy to begin with. But you'd be surprised how handy mustache wax is in an emergency. There have been some close scrapes. For a while there, someone was sabotaging my truck, and I thought I was seeing things. But my friend Sam helped me sort it out. Although, she's had some troubles of her own lately. To be honest, I get a little worried out here sometimes. But I guess that's normal, under the circumstances. Gotta expect a little risk, right? I should be happy. I have great friends and a good paycheck. Anyway, love you, Jenny, and Dad. Please find a way to tell him that he won't find embarrassing. Your and don't worry. I'm looking for the perfect fish to bring back as a Ooh. gift. Your favorite. <laughs> Cushy setup. Must belong to one of those higher uppers. <laughs> That's cute. Did a big entry. Human Resources and Communications License um, reports to Altera HQ personality blah 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 blah. Good morning, Frostpack. Just a quick update to inform you, you of some key achievements and priority shifts we need you all to get behind. The you Spy Pending Project was a resounding success. Please join me in congratulating Samantha IU, who is now reassigned to Outpost Zero, helping us dream of future initiatives. Congratulations are also in order for Danielle Valenti and her team at Omega Lab. The closing of Phi Robotics means important funds can be redirected to their Kara bacteria study, which has important positive implications for the life science. You're all doing an exceptional job, and I don't want to promise anything. But HQ has been taking notice. Keep up the good work. And I think we can start discussing bonuses soon. Alright. Can I have a bonus? Under management skin. I didn't know she had it in her. <laughs> Motivational what? posters were banned from Xenoworks following a lengthy discussion at the annual company retreat three years ago. This poster is technically contraband. Why is... Why is that not allowed? You'll be happy to know the Frost Pack is making excellent progress. I must say, my management style appears to be uniquely well-suited to isolated snow planets. I miss you, of course. But I wonder if you feel it, too. As great as we are together, we're almost better apart. Just look at how well Prosperina did in her last show. I'm sorry I couldn't be there to see it, but... I'm sure if I'd been around... I'd only have made her nervous. Once this mission is over, I'll come home for a few good months. And then, what do you think if we look at reorganizing our expectations to facilitate longer term separation success? I really think this could be a great model for us going forward, romantically and otherwise. Don't forget, I love you from the depths of my heart. Keep on succeeding in your projects. You know there's nothing I find more attractive. What's this? 
Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Sector Zero region scan. Two active human life forms detected. Unauthorized habitat construction and ve vehicular activity detected. So they know we're here. Recommendation, observe and prepare for a possible intervention. So this is a satellite telling them the activity of what's going on. Uh, by them, I mean Altera. <laughs> New employee training. It is recommended that all training and completed be completed while tower is in test mode. Test mode is a fully functional simulated version of live mode. While in test mode, all communication from the tower, including distress signals, security alerts, and spy transmissions will be disabled. To initiate test mode, insert the test override module into the diagnostic port as depicted in the diagram to the left. The activate test mode command may be entered via the terminal once the test override module has been inserted. I don't know what to do with that. I do, bruh. <laughs> I gotta go warm up. Those things are really good. Tower maintenance log. Okay. This time the birds have really done it. I don't know what they've been eating, but it's corrosive when it comes out the other end. I'm gonna need to rewire. I'm short an element to fabricate the right cable. I remember seeing some when I did that dive to the old ship. I'm gonna go out there and see if I can get some more. Is he That's using fixed. code? Maintenance status? In progress. I think he's using code. Um, saying... Bird as in Altera. I, I could be wrong. But I think it's Altera that they're talking about. I uh, don't know exactly where... Oh, wait, no. I do know where to go because... Hold on. Hold on. See monkey nest, set over door small, blah blah blah, blah room plan, or survival equipment, navigator vehicles. Uh, I know I. I become your imminent. Uh, okay, we're good. All right. Um. What was I doing? Where's the map? Okay. Okay, because, I, because I'm sure this video has been going on for a while and I have gotten some things done, um, that's going to be the end of this episode, and I'll see y'all in the next one.